As an oyster fisherman, as romantic, but for the first time a photographic exhibition has opened showing life as it really is. It's part of the week-long oyster festival in Whitstable. Ruth Hockey reports. Fishermen have been catching oysters in Whitstable for 200 years, and throughout that time they've celebrated it with an annual festival. This year, for the first time, one of the oystermen captured colleagues at Sea Salter on film. It's a wonderful sight to be seen, both out on the beds, in the tea room, the warmth of the people, the atmosphere all around. I just thought it was something that needed to be shared with everyone. But not everyone wants to see what they looked like on a cold winter morning. Well, yes, I'll see that one, yeah. Yeah, it's... Um, what did you make of that? Well, yeah, it is, isn't it? It's ugly. It looks like something from... Uh, the Beast from 20,000 years. Yeah, Star Wars or something like that. I don't Especially know. Especially the hand. But, I mean, that's how it was, wasn't it? But for many people in the tight-knit community of Whitstable, Baz is the face of the oyster fishing industry. It reflected the, uh, the day that the photos were taken, the pictures were taken, really, because it was cold and wet and horrific. Bitter cold. I mean, usually we don't wear head gear. Well, I certainly don't, uh, you know, unless it's necessary. But uh, that day we needed to wear it because it was, as the photo shows, horrible, bitter cold. The Whitstable Oyster Festival continues throughout the week. Ruth Hockey for Meridian News.